Hello, my name is Jeffrey Lipton, and today I'm going to show you how to build a Model 2 fab at home. The first stage of making a Model 2 is putting in thermoplastic inserts into the different acrylic pieces. There are approximately 10 acrylic pieces that require different types of inserts. The complete list can be found online in the documentation. The bottom plate will require four thermoplastic inserts in these four corners. Make sure to leave these two holes empty because they will be used for shafts later in the build. You know the top, the correct face is up when this hole is on the left hand side of the plate. To place an insert, take it and put it over the hole it will go into. It should fit gently. If it does not, simply leave it hovering over the hole. You will then take a soldering iron, lift the plate up, place it into the insert and press it onto the acrylic. Give it time to heat up the insert. As the insert heats up, the plastic around it will begin to melt, and you'll be able to force it into the acrylic. As the insert reaches the proper temperature, it will become easier and easier to slide the acrylic piece over the insert. To remove the soldering iron, once the insert is inserted, twist it a couple times and then pull it back out. This is the Z-table support plate. It requires four M2.5 thermoplastic inserts. These inserts must be flush with the surface of the part for later assembly. It does not matter which side the inserts come in on, but be consistent. Make sure to leave this center space empty, as it will be necessary to put a screw through it in later assembly. These are the x-axis tensioner front plates. These are what will control the movement of the tensioner. They require one 4 millimeter thermoplastic insert each. These inserts go in the only hole on the plate. It does not matter which direction these inserts are inserted from. These are the x and y-axis tensioner front plates. They each require a single 4 millimeter threaded insert. These inserts can be placed in the hole from either direction. The pillow blocks for the x-axis will each require two 632 thermoplastic inserts. They must be placed from the same side to ensure that they fit snugly against the machine. This is the base plate of the bridge of the Fabit Home Model 2. It will require eight thermoplastic inserts in these eight holes. These inserts should be for the M2.5 threaded screw. There are three types of belt clamp in the Fab at Home system. One has these long grooves on the side. This is a sliding belt clamp. One has small holes on the side and is a through hole belt clamp. The large hole on the side is for threaded inserts. These will take 2.5 millimeter threaded inserts. It does not matter which direction the insert comes in from, but it should be consistent. Additionally, when placing the insert in, it will bow out to the side. That is fine. You don't need to worry about recutting a laser cut part that bows out from the insert. This is the Z-table support plate. It requires four 632 thermoplastic inserts. These are used to constrain the top plate when it is fully assembled. This is the Z-table top plate. It requires four 632 threaded inserts in these four corners. It doesn't matter which side they're placed in from, but make sure that they are flush with, with whichever side they are inserted from.